Hey guys, it's Mark for GeekBeat. Those of you who know me may know that I like to draw, especially on electronic devices like an iPad, whether it's playing draw something or just making my latest masterpiece, uh, I like to draw. And I've been using all kinds of styluses and I'm gonna bring you today my top three. Number three, let's start from the bottom up. This is the Nomad Play. And you may be looking at this and going, that's a paintbrush, you darn fool. And that's the cool thing about this stylus is that it looks like a paintbrush, it feels like a paintbrush, but it's actually a stylus. It's a capacitive stylus and it's freaking awesome. The thing that I like about these brush style styluses is there's little, there is no friction against the stylus to the screen. So that makes it really easy to use. Let's move on to number two. I really like that one. The Nomad Play, it's about 30 bucks. I like it a lot. Number two is the uh, Pogo Sketch Plus. Now Pogo has been making styluses since like the iPhone first came out. This is their newest model. Pretty awesome, it's nice, it's a, it has like a nice feel to it. It's not big like this one. This is why this one is better because it's thinner. It, uh, the only thing I don't like about it is it has a little resistance. You know, that friction really bothers me. And also the nub over here is really delicate. So when you talk to it, you have to talk very softly and don't call it names. But seriously, it's really good. It just feels good. It works. Pogo Sketch Plus, about 15 bucks. Cheaper than the last one. Number one, my favorite, the Nomad Brush. It combines both of these worlds into one. It has a thin form factor. On this end, it has a brush, just like the Play, but the Play is kind of big and bulky. It's kind of made for kids. You can tell it has a rocket ship on it. I don't know. This is made for men like me. Urgh. Just kidding. And on the other end, uh, it has a, it looks like a brush too, but it's a lot smaller. I actually prefer this end over the big brush because it lets me be precise like I am with the Pogo Sketch Plus but it gives me the zero friction like I get with the brush style styluses and it works awesome. I just really like the way that feels. This is the Nomad brush, it's about 40 bucks. You get the two tips and I believe they're working on more because you can see it screws out so I'm excited to see what they do with it. Um, you know, I know a lot of people are against styluses but if you're an artist or you want to take notes, trust me, they really help out. Um, it's better than finger painting I think, unless that's your thing. So if you're looking for a stylus, pick one of these, I think you'll be good to go. And uh, that's about it for me. For more reviews, go to our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash geekbeattv. And I am out of here. Goodbye for now.